Talking with Mitchell Ludwig from the Kemper Boys golf team after they finish up their round here with the Carroll Tigers at the Carroll Country Club. And uh, Mitchell, a pretty decent round for you today overall. How did you feel about it? I felt pretty good. It, it could have been better, but overall pretty good. How did you start out today? I started out with a bogey, then went par, then went bogey, but overall I felt pretty good about what I did. Mentally, uh, you know, this is the kind of the city rivalry between you two. You guys see each other in tournaments throughout the year, but uh, mentally, what were you thinking going into this one today? I thought we had a pretty good chance, and today, yeah, everyone did pretty good, but yes, yeah, rivalry, and everyone likes to beat each other. What do you guys talk about when you're out there on the course with each other? Uh, we just talk like we normally do, just like we're friends, but we all want to beat each other. Uh, you, you said kind of a par bogey. Did that kind of last you throughout most of the round today? Yeah, kind of, sort of, but every now and then I had that like, double, and then I took a trip on one hole, but you get through it. How'd you hit off the tee box today? Hit pretty good off the tee box. Probably just one that I didn't hit very far. What were you kind of averaging for distance? Uh, 230 maybe. The one that I hit short probably went over just a little bit under 100. Feel more comfortable today on the par threes, fours, or fives? I feel more comfortable on the par threes because I felt I could get it more closer and go for pars or birdies. Did you did you shoot pars and birdies on some of those? Yeah, I shot most pars on par threes. Overall, how'd the putting go for you today? That was pretty good. A couple three putts, but overall, one putts and two putts. Did you drop down any 10 foot longer putts today? I had one 15 foot par putt. Which hole was that on? Take us through that shot, if you would. Uh, well, I think it was on five, maybe. And that was the one where I hit it short off the drive. And then I had a really good wood, three wood shot, and it put me about 100 yards off the green. And I put it on the back of the green and take that for par. Were you playing fairways for the most part today? Yeah, had a little. Had some in the rough, but overall mostly in the fairways. How's this transition to varsity golf going for you this year? Oh, pretty good. I thought I had a pretty good chance, but I'm glad that I'm on varsity. What's the biggest difference you've noticed uh, in, in the meets and in the tournaments between the JV and the varsity level? Uh, I think it's the competition and the level that all these other guys play at. Like in JV, everyone's like, yeah, let's go out there and try to win. But in varsity, everyone's like, okay, let's go out there and shoot our best, and that's what I'm trying to do. What are the, some of the things that you've picked up maybe from some of your veteran teammates this year? Uh, play every hole like it's your last I and mean, don't get frustrated at one hole and just get through it. All right, tell you what, I appreciate you joining us here today. Congratulations on the round. Best luck the rest of the year. Yep, thanks.